New at 10, an area community celebrates the opening of a facility that aims to help those needing help. That's where we find Isaac Dennison in Weston with a look at what it's offering and how it plans to help people. The building I'm in right now is the realization of a five-year process all in the name of simply trying to help people who really need it. And maybe by next week, this bed will go to someone that has also needed it. A celebration of the area's newest recovery facility. You know, five years ago, all it was was one crazy idea. That idea turning into the Gospel TLC, which stands for Transformational Living Center, made in an effort to transform people's lives. This community needs this facility because there are a lot of people out there that are suffering with addiction. The center will also accept those who are suffering from homelessness or anything else that might have left them broken. One soon-to-be resident was really down on his luck. Okay. I went and knocked on every door, salvation, warming, and they were all full and overcrowded. Because of the doors opening up for me, I have a chance to make it out there too. The hope is more people like Paul can earn those second chances and in the meantime have a place to stay. We just really want to invite anybody that's looking for transformation to come and be able to find that transformation or facility. Right now this is a male only facility that can house up to 16 at a time but all the beds are about to fill up. There's just so many of us out there that is struggling with addiction and me myself I, I would like to reach out there and help the ones that are still drowning. But hey, look at me, I, I'm, I come through here. The first residents move in next week and the hope is creating plenty of success stories. No success stories are gonna make this place shine. In Weston, Isaac Dennison, News 9 WAOW.